guys welcome back i got roasted a little bit in yesterday's video because i was just going into the arena and ben Lybrand said i should have used tron now he's not actually wrong i didn't even think of that i was just sort of doing my normal sort of rubbishy team now it was one i couldn't beat was it up here yeah this one here no it was the one that had um Timon and Pumba in. Because he was saying if I use Tron, it would knock off all the debuffs. Where is that one? I swear it had Timon and Pumba in. It's Timon. <laughs> Simone. I, um, wait, what's his name? You guys know what I mean. Don't judge me. Unless he's changed his team. There it is. Okay. So he was saying if I put Tron in, which is a very good because I don't need Pecon. It's Bill, you pointed out. Bill, you pointed out here. Why did you put Pokonis on your arena attack team when there's no heroes in your team to buff, which is true. He only uses Pokonis with the same team heroes. Also, Cosimodo is a ridiculous shielder. So that's Bill Yu. And Joanna Pope said, if you do not max Ducky and Bunny out next video, I'll die. I, I, I will have to revive you. I will work on Ducky and Bunny. So I'm going to put Tron in here. Because actually, I've never thought about it. Tron with a speed up buff from Cosimodo could be very good, but there's a chance that Tron could die immediately by Baymax. Yeah. So I, I, the thing is, I'm not going to be able to sort of balance that out unless I put in. Yeah, because every single time I launch this, Tron's just going to die immediately. So let, let's let's get into Tron because Tron is a good character. He's only level three ten. Let's get him up a few levels there, right? <laughs> That's basically done nothing, but I've leveled him up um, 60 times. Let's try that again. He's probably still going to die straight away. So it's probably not going to help at all. Here we go. Come on, Tron. Do do me wonders here. That's what I asked for. Yeah. Oh. Baymax is always just going to wipe out like my best people in this. But I agree with him. If I had my Tron on a good level... He would have just wiped all of the debuffs off all those characters. So, yeah, this this level still has dominated me. Unfortunately, it's still taken the lead. It's taken a strong lead on me here, guys. But yeah, unfortunate. But it is still overpowering, just a little bit. So I'm still stuck. A very good team here. So if you guys wanted to look at a team to use, that is a very good one. So fair play to who's defeated me, Johnny. D Johnny Johnny <laughs> I don't know whatever that says <laughs> so well done now today's video I wanted to jump in to the story they've brought out the next level of story now so we've got chapter 60 I think they're actually on 66 now but what I've been doing is I've just been using these like four characters to show how ridiculous they are so it's just what watch like, the combo here oh everyone Elsa killed everyone. Elsa just destroyed everyone. And then Cosimodo just runs through. That's how ridiculous. Like, I just wanted to bring this to your attention of how ridiculous. I want to do a bit of a silly combo here. Cosimodo with my Donnies at the back, right? Just watch how ridiculous Cosimodo is. Even the shout that they're doing. You saw just when they're shouting, they're lowering the amount of energy everyone's gaining. And they're just doing so much damage. Like, okay, yes, I haven't actually got them to, you know, the world's greatest level, so technically they're not particularly usable. But, yeah, I want to do the um, Cosimodo, Bolt, and then just a load of healers combo. Now, you just watch Bolt. Just watch Bolt do his thing. It's stupid. I'll put um, Kermit on as well for buffs. Now. So, we're getting the shields from Joy. And Bolt just kills everyone with his speed up. And look at those buffs that I've got. That's why I like having Kermit on. Because any buffs that are sort of lurking will be pushed onto all the other enemies. So Cosimodo, Bolt and Kermit, honestly, are a phenomenal team. So once again, we're going to get the speed up used here. Look, look, at the, look at the attack speed. And Kermit just strums his guitar ultra fast, which is heal, 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 heal. So it's a very, very good team, these guys. Now, I haven't... Um, I was using it earlier. Obviously... This could be a good one to use in the um, arena. So if we can jump into the arena here and I'll show you that team. I want to try it on. Uh, but again, the problem I'm going to have is that Baymax is probably still going to kill everyone instantly. So if I load this team up, right, I want to try it in here. Knock off, knock off. 
Healer. Healer. Hmm. I might... No, I'm going to put Aero on. Let's see if Baymax doesn't kill everyone straight away again here. Yes, okay, we resisted it. Oh, but Cosimodo, obviously, we had that cheeky freeze at the start. We still got... <laughs> Kermit is still alive. This is basically now going to end... Oh, they actually killed Cosimodo as well. I want to kill this the most unorthodox way possible. So I'll take Ariel off. I'm going to put on... Um... Shigo doesn't work because of the debuff. Ducky and Bunny. Ducky and Bunny can carry this for me, all right? I dedicate this one to Joa. They all died. Okay, you guys didn't see that. You guys didn't see that. I'm quitting out. Right, so back to chapter 64 here. Now, it's, I just, I love doing these silly little combos on story mode. Just having the ultra sort of speedy heal is so good. So I wanted to ask you guys, what are your sort of silly combos that you use, which are quite overpowered, but obviously quite unorthodox. So like, for example, you wouldn't be able to go and use them in the arena because they're not meta. But this is kind of like my own approach to a, to a meta team of just sort of healing. Oh, Bolt's tied. Oh, no, why? Why? It doesn't matter. It's not a freestyle level. Oh, absolutely did himself vial there. Here we go. Lovely. Just look out, look at Cosimodo just basically doing nothing and just staying alive for an infinite amount of time. It's the amount of buffs which is so stupid. Oh no, they've killed Joy. Oh, Honey just ran through and killed everyone. So I'm, I'm not surprised by that. You've got to let me have that one. So I'm going to do a swap out here. I love it. Whenever you're in doubt of anything, just throw Baymax in. There we, there we go. Lovely. I haven't worked endlessly on Baymax for no reason. He's literally my carry. So I just wanted to make a bit of a, a bit of a silly quick video for you guys today. I wanted to know what some of your silly teams are that you like. Like for example, Cosimodo and Bolt with Kermit and Joy and Ariel is just a stupid hill team to keep Bolt alive. Or I mean, you just saw the amount of buffs I had then. Ridiculous. So yeah, comment down below some of your more, um, I'd say like gimmicky teams. They, I'm not talking about teams that you go and use in Arena, because Arena, you need a very set team to basically prevail. So for example, in the Arena, is if you've got Baymax in, you'll normally win, or if you've got Cosimodo for shielding, or if you've got Slinky maxed out, or, you know, there's characters for PvP, which are very, very common to use. Shigo is quite a commonly used one as well. And again, I know I've covered this with you guys before, but one of the best ways to kind of jump in and see the best team is to just go into the old um, rankings arena number one. So I can see in my area, this guy's number one. So why is he number one? Matt Hash is a very meta character with his debuffs. We've got Cosimodo. He's a very, uh, sorry, Phobius, obviously he's speed up. Baymax flies through and kills everyone. The Mora can't die. I'm actually not too sure on Helga. So again, what, what can you see is common? This is always what I ask people. Baymax, 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 Baymax. Baymax, 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 Baymax. So you guys kind of get the point here, right? That you can kind of learn what character you should work on. So in the arena, we obviously have Baymax. He's a very overpowered character. So it kind of comes in bits like that. So yeah, I just did a bit of a random video today, but I, I want you guys to comment down below and let me know your sort of more ridiculous teams. And I want to review them in tomorrow's. So I'll be replying to all comments. So do make sure you guys comment down below. I want to know your silly teams. I'll see you legends all in the next one.